Let me offer you one more variety of a snowflake shaped decoration for a Christmas tree. It is a saving variety both in time and in the amount of tubes. It is woven on the base of two triangles as well. In this case, I've taken glossy paper. It is that very case when you can uh, use advertising papers. The only thing that they have to be very, very thin. I've cut uh, every sheet uh, into four stripes. I've used a knitting needle two and a half millimeters thick, a bit thicker than I usually use, and I've rolled some tubes like this. The matter is that tubes have to be rather rigid and to have a thicker and a thinner side. It is very important. Then I mark 7 cm from a thinner side. Mark and fold. 1, 2, 3. That is, I need uh, 3 folds to get a triangle. Cut an extra part. And insert a thinner part into a thicker one. That is, the first stage is the same as uh, in the previous uneconomical snowflake. Make a second triangle in the same way. This part has uh, come out too thin and they don't uh, fit uh, very well. So we cut some more because it is very important to get an uh, equilateral triangle. In this case our snowflake will be smooth. Now cross them. One, two, Three. They all have to be crossed this way as well. So, we have made two triangles, cross them with each other, smoothed, and further we join a working tube and start wrapping. One, two. On the second coil already it gets fixed. Nothing moves. So we make several such coils. It is why it was important to have different sides, a thick and a thin one, to make it easy to connect the tubes. Make several coils in different directions. At first the snowflake doesn't look very nice because of multicolored pages with letters and figures. Somewhere here we can fix it. Just lead under the coil. It is enough. Drop some glue here underneath and cut. That's all. Our economical snowflake is ready. It is the way it looks as a draft, and it is the way it looks after I have sprayed it with paint and stuck some icicles onto it. It looks even more like a snowflake than our star. It is more airy and light, and it deserves to decorate a Christmas tree.